can never have too many crappy ideas. Specifically whenever it comes to free world travel and- Wait, is that a fire? What? Hello, can I hit it? Oh my gosh, I got a little boost, huh? Forget crappy ideas, this is amazing. And is that a Kraken? Hang on, no. My first run and I'm already being drowned. Perfect. I do have enough to buy the upgrade where I get more money for these porcelain potties, so that sounds good to me. If I spend money to make more money, then I'll just have more money to spend that makes me money. I got $1,100 off that. Yeah, I'm beginning to think buying that porcelain thing was a good idea. I'll make stars more frequent. I'm not really sure what those do. And then I'll give myself more speed. The more fun items I can fit in the air, the better I'm off. And I really do didn't get anything out of that. <laughs> Wait, I'm currently level zero. What happens whenever I hit level one? $1,900? How many toilets did I hit right there? Let me upgrade these again if they're going to be that profitable. And my stars. I believe stars level me up and the bronze toilets give me a lot of money. I think that was 800 bucks. Hello. Oh, and I'm level one. All right, game. What happens now? Oh, I need levels to buy the rocket pod. I'm just earning so much money per run. I just have to keep upgrading the toilets. That way I just get stacks of money. And there's triple XP stars. Hello. Now my leveling up should be even faster. And my money earning should be even fat. Just everything's faster now. Yep, that was $1,200. And oh, I can start buying plane parts now. Something tells me I'm about to start going very, very far, very, very fast. This is what we call investing. And wow, I am flying. How much money did I just earn right there? $19,000. I can buy the final potty upgrade and still have plenty of money to upgrade the booths. I just need to keep collecting a ton of money because I have an evil idea that involves me having these plane wings as well. <laughs> However, there's still one upgrade that I'm wanting to save up for, which means that I die. <laughs> 34,000. It's a shame I'm still not able to buy the upgrade I want because it cost $50,000. However, for me, that's probably just one more run. And wow, I was right. Now I can buy the bulldozer, which means all my runways are clear for the rest of the game. That actually was a very good investment. Thank you, game. Now, I don't know if me landing this properly will actually let me move on to the next area. It looks like I still have tricks to do. All right, I'll buy the freaking loop maneuver, whatever. Now that I have almost every upgrade maxed, this is going to be child's play. Perfect. Now I just have to make sure I don't mess up and land properly. Just like that. What's the new area have for me? Oh, all my upgrades are still maxed. That just means I need to buy the new plane parts. Wow, that was extremely easy. All right, uh, to how far can I get off the new plane I just built? It looks like I still have to do four of these tricks. Oh, I don't have the inverted flight. Whatever, I'll just see how far I can go. Well, I'm completely out of boost, so I just have to sit here and free fall, presumably to my doom. And would you look at that? I presumed right. <laughs> <laughs> Hi game, how much money do I get for this? 56,000, yep, I'll take it. So it looks like I'll always need the tricks no matter which area I'm in. This should be it. I think I might be able to actually make it all the way to 8K, provided the game just keeps giving me my little fire boost to go all the way up in the air. However, I haven't hit a rocket boost in so very long. Oh yes, I hit one flame. I think that might've been all I needed. This is gonna be so very close. I think I did it, yes! Oh, I just have to land safely, which I do because I'm a pro. Bring me at $100,000. That lets me upgrade my speed once again. <laughs> And I might as well get the last trick while I'm at it. Oh, I forgot to save money for the plane. Uh-oh. We might have to do a couple runs before we're able to make it to the end this time. And my target height is 8,000 meters. Maybe it'll be more than a couple runs. Despite not having a fully built plane, they're nothing but sheer tenacity. I managed to earn $142,000. <laughs> all right, give me the full plane now, please. Now I can finally do all the tricks I'm supposed to do. I love the very obvious 3D model <laughs> of when you do tricks. It looks so goofy. Come on, please let me keep being lucky. Superman, hello again. Oh, and here we go, beginning the descent to death. All that and still enough to buy one more speed. Now I just need $150,000. <laughs> I'm sure it'll all work out. And on my conquest to level up, I finally have enough money to max out my speed as well. How do I get these locked upgrades, huh? Those look cool. This has to be one of the luckiest runs that I've ever gotten. I'm over 8,000 meters and I still have 73 fuel left. I, I don't know what's happened. I pretty much assumed I wasn't going to be able to beat this without another like rocket booster or something. But there's hope in my eyes once more. And yes, I hit that fire. Please, one more would guarantee that I beat this. Wait, I think I only need to go like 200 meters. Yes, never mind. I'm going to beat this no matter what. Deploy my gear. Perfect. 
Yeah, yeah, I already know how this process goes. The Cuban 8 just actually does cover the entire screen. I hit so many upgrades. However, I'm so close to being level 20. Can I just get like three more stars, please? I think I literally just need one more. There it is. Yeah, perfect. Level 20. And am I going to outer space? I am. Oh my God, it's the moon. <laughs> I'm going to Goku! Hello! I'm traveling so far, so fast, and so high. I still need a thousand meters in height left though. I guess it makes sense there's not like fire in space. That's how kind of vacuums work and science and stuff. If the game could give me one anyways, I appreciate it. Oh, wow, and it listened. I only need to make it another 5,000 meters and then I'm, I'm on to the next area again. It's so fast. And I broke the record. Well, it was nice to use this plan for only one run. <laughs> Give myself maximum fuel. And before I buy any crazy upgrades, I should probably buy all my plane parts. Oh, and I can still afford the super rocket engine. Awesome. Well, this looks menacing. Okay. Why is there no tricks required for this one? And why is my height all question marks? But I guess there's only one way to find out what it means. And then simply to go as high as possible. There's Goku again, which I, have, I must be doing good. It stopped giving me fire boost which is what usually happens when I approach my goal. I also don't have to do any tricks for this run. What is going on? Oh, look, it's Mars. And, oh, I, I guess I did it. I did something. Oh, did I just crash land on Mars? Hang on. I'm exploring outer space. It makes sense that I'll need a space helmet. So it looks like the oxygen means I'm actually on like a small timer and I, I'm just gonna assume I die. I mean, that. <laughs> what else does one person do when they run out of oxygen in the infinite cosmos? Well, I guess I'm about to find out what happens. Please, I don't want to black out and die. Looks like I have to plummet to a UFO tractor beam? What? Yeah, I think that went well. But now that I have the body, I don't think anything will actually change. I still, <laughs> I will run out of oxygen and probably die. And to get the rest of the body, I'm gonna need $250,000. So it looks like I'm gonna be here for a second. I wonder what comes first, level 25 or a full UFO? It looks like it was my money. By Hoverlander, engine, and the wings and stabilizer, cause we have a spaceship now, baby. And just a couple more stars, yep, there's level 25. It looks like with my upgrades now, I'll easily be able to meet the distance and height requirement, cause I have to force myself to stay this low, because I start running out of oxygen if I go over a thousand meters, so my only means of getting money is by just hovering near death at the very bottom. However, I have learned that a ton of the good upgrades spawn here at the very bottom, so I need to hang out here more often. Like, look at that, that was like seven golden toilets. I'm thinking I should have plenty of money after this run to be able to buy all those new upgrades that I earned. Yeah, $238,000 should do it. <laughs> buy an oxygen tank, a rocket pod, a force field generator, I guess. And I can even buy the trick I need to do. Wait, I have everything I need. I actually might be able to get out of here with this extremely long and extremely cool trick. Hang on. Don't worry, game. I have all day for you to just sit here and do that. Yeah, that's fine. However, I'm not going up in height as fast as I was back on Earth. And I need to get to 14,000 meters, game. So if you want to pick up the amount of uh, fireballs that spawn, please. Thank you. Okay, wow, it heard me. Like I always say, just complain and things will start working out. <laughs> On the giant climb to get more height, I also have 8,000 meters in distance. And because of my generator, I haven't even lost any oxygen yet. Wait. Oh, please. Yes, fire. Perfect. That's exactly what I needed. Give me another. Yes. Give me like four more, <laughs> please. I'm so close. I just got to go 600 more meters up. Past 14,000. Yes. Okay. Entering asteroid field. Well, that's scary. Let's just dive back down. All I gotta do is make it a little ways across. A simple, you know, 5,000 more meters on only 20 fuel. You can do this, me. You got your UFO license back when you were a child. It was one of the weirdest training courses I've ever been to, but boy, am I glad I took it. I'm only 200 meters away. Yes, use my boost to just be sure I get myself there. What does it mean by landing gear? I have no landing gear. Suddenly, I am very, very afraid of what's below. Maybe there's auto landing gear in the game for me. Oh, wow, yeah, no, there is, cool. I'm once again setting records. And there's a poo orb? I always gotta remember to buy my spaceship before before I do anything, cause wow, I only have $29,000 left. However, I got a pretty sick looking ship out of it. Oh, but unfortunately it requires a trick I don't have. I can't win this run even if I wanted to. Whatever, money farming it is. I'd say that was successful. So now I can buy this $100,000 poo orb and max out my oxygen, as well as get both of the final tricks I'm gonna need. All right, spaceship, take me where I need to go. And what's the second trick? Oh, I'm just... 
<laughs> Summoning a satellite? Okay. Is that my mom? My girlfriend? Both? I don't know. Luckily, I'm able to go a distance without actually having to use my boost quite yet. Almost to it. Just a little more. There's 9,000. So I'm halfway on height now. I am, however, not halfway on distance. That is that is a ways away. My God. Hi, Goku. Here to see me off on my way to godhood. Or at least wherever I'm going. Hi, Goku again. What? Is there two of you? Are you Vegeta now? Well, I've uh, officially stopped getting fire orbs at 13,000 which is not a spot I'd like to stop getting fire orbs at. Asteroid field. Oh, that can't be good. Come on, I'm just 2,000 meters away. Oh, I hit an asteroid. Stop my speed? What? What happened to my force field? Whatever, just a little more. I'm so close. Please touch it. That's all. Yes, 18,000. Awesome. Now I can plummet back out of the asteroid field. What are those, huh? Game, do we have a couple more uh, fireballs to give me? I'm back in the I need to go fast range. Yeah, there we go. Thank you, game. Oh, but I'm still about 4,000 meters away. Luckily, I'm at 7,000 meters in height, but I only have one tiny fuel boost left. No. Oh, last resort. Oh, wait. The poo orb is just like more fuel or like double, I guess. I was worried I wasn't going to be able to make it 25,000 meters because my fuel was running out. I didn't know I had a whole entire spare tank. Thank you, poo orb. Oh, hi, Superman. Natural of you to show up now that I'm doing well. Jerk. And we did it! 25,000 meters broken. Now I can essentially just use all my speed and boost and then, you know, plummet to my safety. It still frightens me that I don't have landing gear. But I guess the power of zero gravity has always saved people before. How much money did it- $500,000? Okay, no, that that's good. It's my final area now, Saturn. Wow, and all these upgrades are very expensive. It's a shame that I'm rich. And it looks like I can buy another super rocket engine and another little generator. 20,000 meters in height, 30,000 meters in distance. Lesser men have tried and failed. However, I'm simply better. I'm getting to the point where I'm about to reach the asteroid belt again, and what is that? That was horrifying. Oh, wait, I still have to do my tricks. No, I keep forgetting. Luckily, I'm only about 5,000 meters away from my target height, so I think I'll be able to do this in time, and that was the wrong trick. With my double extra booster, I'm actually able to go flying up here, and I guess there's no asteroids in this part? And I passed my halfway mark for distance. With the amount of fuel that I have left over, oh, never mind, here's the asteroid field. However, I still have about like 40 left in my fuel. So if I just, what am I doing right now? What, am I aiming at something? Hello? Oh wait, there's 20K. Okay, I can get out of here. Get out of the asteroid field. That's a UFO. Did I just call that UFO over? Okay, well this is like a 29 second trick. So I really got to make sure I don't fall by then. So I've got my height and I'm just under 10,000 meters away in distance. Considering I'm still 15,000 meters into the air, I think I'm going to be all right. I'll actually let myself plummet here for a bit. That way I can go back to getting the little fire orbs. And now that I'm about 10,000 meters in height, I will just travel forward. Hello game, where are the fireballs at exactly? You know, I came down here to get a single boost and I haven't gotten one. I wonder if it's because I'm too far distant that it stopped spawning them. I guess I could go back to using this trick and hope I hit one that's off screen or something. Oh wait, I'm only 3,000 meters away, yes! Oh, I only have 12 fuel left though. Wait, I don't see the poo orb on this. Was the poo orb specific to that one spacecraft? Oh no. Come on, a thousand meters more, use my fuel. Oh, I have one tiny fuel thing left. It's okay, wait, I'm only 500 meters out. I think I'll get there before I actually plummet to my death. Yes, we did it. Oh no, and I still have poo orb boost. In that case, let's just dive straight down. I don't want my oxygen to run out and I see that it's actually depleting as well. So the faster I fall, the better. And I've officially arrived. All the way to Uranus, it looks like. Yeah, this is a fitting planet for this crappy idea. Hey there, normally the video would end, but this time I have something important to share with you guys. You, the lovely viewer, now have the option to actually become a channel member. You can join in at the pro level that'll give you all these fun little goodies, or you can join in at the legend level, which costs just a little bit more and you get one to three extra videos per month. So if you have some extra change lying around, you feel like supporting the channel, go ahead and join on up. If not, I still appreciate you watching the videos, staying subscribed and just interacting and seeing those comments down below. But that's all from me. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.